Wally Upshaw, cosplay complete. Hello, it's me again. Hello, Wally and everybody else. So I've decided if we're going to be witches, we're going to have to actually be witches. So mum and I went rooting through all the boxes we had under our bed, looking for all the witchy stuff we had as kids, and um, we found a bunch of cool stuff, including this fake witchy book from the 90s, but actually might be real. Anyways, it's a lot easier to get through than all of Erica's old text prosy shit. It has pictures. Speaking of Erica, she has taken it upon herself to train me. Which translates to me being basically her lab rat because she knows fuck all about born witches. So yeah, while you have these two big organizations with loads of information, I have one 20 year old with absolutely nothing. Insert incredibly slow training montage here. Wikipedia? Yeah, that was the first one I read. Oh, really? Yeah, I like puns. Did you find anything interesting in it that wasn't a pun? No, they all say the same thing. Natural born witches need to be supervised constantly. Blah, blah. Need to be trained from a super young age. Blah, blah. Whatever me and Wally haven't been doing. What are you doing? If I'm gonna have a telekinetic in my room, I don't want to be cleaning up glass and volatile substances. Volatile substances? How do you pass room inspection? Harding's bone. Took a lot of energy too. Have you read Witch Wars? Ah! Oh. Okay, so what you need to do is to stay there, concentrate, keep going. From what we can gather, your abilities are affected by intense emotion. Anger. Stress. Right. Right. So, what if we were to trigger them? That's what I thought. Look, Agatha, we're not going to get anywhere if you're going to continue being so stubborn. Whoa, hey. Calm. Calm, okay? Look, you don't have to be here if you don't want to, okay, Jen? She's here for the emotional balance. support. Have you read Letters on Demonology and Witchcraft yet? I've like read the first chapter, but it's so bloody dense. They can't throw in a comma once in a while, can they? Look up Pathokinesis. Look, fine, sure, whatever. Good. Should you be this far back? I'm just keeping a distance. I mean, I can't move anything an inch, let alone burn your room down. Nothing wrong with taking some safety precautions. You call lighting two candles in a room safety precautions? Just, uh, look, just start reciting the incantation and we'll- <laughs> That is so, like, like, straight little wrong call, isn't it? It is. Do you like, do you like coffee? I like coffee. <laughs> do you like food? That's like a straight people yeah. thing, actually. No, like, yeah, liking yeah, coffee, I, I, liking I, I, coffee I, I, to begin with is kind of a straight people thing. I'm very like, coffee. Coffee. Coffee's coffee's okay, amazing. Coffee's okay, but like, it's a straight people thing, you know what I mean? Like, you yeah, can yeah, like yeah. coffee and, and not be straight, but it's a straight people thing. Yeah, that's true. Hmm. Pokemon Go? Pokemon Go, yeah. Pokemon Go, what team? Mystic. Vala! Mystic! Vala! Vala! is rubbish. I hate him. <laughs> Alright, like, I'm not a big fan of Scrappy D, but like, you don't need to talk to him. Like, so it's gonna be like really? Marks and Spencer, I think, like, they're taking over. I thought it meant like, like Karl Marx <laughs> for a second. I wish I was there. Like What's it like? Honestly, I, I want to join you. <laughs> you don't. Trust me. Yeah, I, I guess it's, I kind of like that thing, you know, like, um, it really pisses me off when Cisco was like, oh no, you don't want breasts, that's such a problem. N no, I do. <laughs> I get you, I'm sorry. That Not was I, no. That is my living privilege. I can sing that because I'm like white. If you like white. white. <laughs> no, no, I am white, but I'm, I'm like. You're white? <laughs> Scrappy Doo, I really. Why am I like Scrappy Doo again? Why, why do you keep complaining about Scrappy Doo? I don't like it. I know you have a compass on hand. Ask Alistair, he's weird enough. Uh, SE shop if not, though. I'll go ask it now. Hey, don't blow up my room while I'm gone. Cross my heart. You know, she says that to me every time she leaves the room now. It's not like I can even control these stupid powers. You'll get better. I mean, sure, maybe. It's anyone's guess, really. Don't really know. Not Erica's, certainly. I guess. Hey, did you, um... Did you read that book she told you to? 
Which one, Jen? She gave me about five million. The one about demons. Um, I don't think so. I've read a couple that mention demons in passing, but not the one about demons. Why did you ask? No reason. Okay. No, no, that's really shit of me. Okay, promise you won't freak out. Okay, I promise. No, no, you, you can freak out if, if you want. I'm not going to hold you to anything. Sure, it's okay, I'm, I'm not going to freak out. It's all right. What's in this book that you're so worried about? Okay. Um, some demons have powers. Kind of like witches. Right. Um, except ours are more part of us. I don't know. What kind of powers, Tell? Um, well, the kind of demon that I am is um, pathokinetic, among other things. Okay, what, what does pathokinetic mean? It means sensing and influence over control of others' emotions. Whoa. Yeah. So when you said emotional support... Yeah. I mean, I try not to do it, or I don't control, but being in the same room as me might change how you feel to mimic how I do. Right. It is that why I feel kind of scared right now, Jim? Maybe. Maybe I'm just scary. <laughs> Jim, no. I mean, yeah, but um, I'm scary too, if, if that helps. I guess. Man, I just wanted to go to a normal uni. <laughs> Student housing really fucked you on that one, huh? See, look, I can do it too, the emotional thing. I'm, I'm glad you told me. Me too. So, um, did you want to... No, look! No one has a compass anywhere. Oh, no. Really? Really? You said you wanted to watch it. I know, I know, but seriously. So you want... Turn it off, please. What was she talking about? One, there isn't even one in New York. And two, Wally doesn't seem like the kind of person- Erica, can you seriously not go through a conversation without interrupting me once? Sorry. It's just, don't you hate it when people who are technically politically aligned with you make the rest of you seem completely unreasonable? Uh, yeah, actually, it's- Shit. Like, of course I want to know more about magic, but what she's suggesting... What is she suggesting? I didn't want to tell you so soon. Erica? I'll go get Gemma. Uh, no. Why? Is something going to be angry? Because you know that me knowing about it is just going to make it even worse and... If she gets angry, it'll only... All right, all right. Good. So? The... Entities that the lady was talking about. They come about in times of great emotional significance. Wars, disasters, scenes of fervent devotion. I mean, the last one doesn't really happen that much anymore. People have tried to name them, but the one that's stuck in the Western world is the id. Like Freud? The super ego or stuff? Sort of. I don't really like it because of associations, but it's happened. And people with enough power, or the potential for it anyway, they go up against them and they fight. One of three things can happen. The person dies. They banish the id into nothingness, or something in between. What? 
they combine. If the person's emotional state matches the ids well enough, then the id takes over. And more often than not, the person becomes something they feared they would they could never be. That's how we get monsters. So what's that got to do with me? That's why I'm here. It's what Mrs. Grey and her followers are keeping in the forest. People like me, we try to contain it. And maybe try to experiment and see what it would become occasionally, but nothing even close to merging. Agatha, I don't know what's happening in New York. But if Bryony is serious about the risks that she's saying she would take, then I don't... She's way more dangerous than I thought she was. I, I don't agree with the series court morals, but... I don't see why we're supposed to choose. This whole thing is stupid. There's no reason for us to be involved in any of this. And, and Wally, he's, he's nothing like what you're saying. He could get angry, yeah, obviously, but... No! I wish I was there. I wish he'd just listen to me. I want to be able to just reach out and help. That's it. What? Your powers. It's when... When you want people to listen, when you want to help. This is going to make future experiments much more productive. Oh.